Hello everyone, and today we will continue to create our own project, our own building. Uh, today we will create the columns and uh, shafts. Also, we will create, uh, we will start create the staircase. Uh, so, as before, how to open our project? Go to open, or you can use the file open, uh, uh, how you want. Go to the your folder, Revit project and here the, is our central file uh, click on them don't forget about the create new local ok overwrite existing file that's it just wait and now uh, we will go to level 1 don't forget we're using only working space to work because for prepare we will use uh, uh, on in the end I mean like a bit later uh, as you understand we cannot say anything because uh, here this 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 is our uh, floor so we can hide floor like this just right uh, just left click right click and wait sorry this one right click and hide in view for example elements for example like this or you just can use uh, wireframe mode i will use for wireframe mode and no one have hide anything now for now okay we will start from uh, our staircase because our staircase it's uh, pretty same in uh, all levels uh, i will start from here so what we're gonna do we need the walls let's go to the wall let's choose uh, interior some interior wall we need generic because uh, the wall around uh, staircase using only generic uh, let's see which one which one will be okay for us to okay first uh, I will change uh, location because I don't like when it's from the middle okay let's see no it's a bit a bit bigger than 200 I think it's 250 yes it is and as you see here the column just leave it let's draw first the boundary here 400 I think where is our 400 we need 400 uh, we have 375 I think it's uh, it's not enough it's I think it's quiet, uh, it's cannot, uh, I can't understand, it's 375 or 400, but uh, it can be 375, okay, leave it like that. And as you see here also one more column. But here it's clearly, here as you see, here as you see it's a uh, really big one, here yeah, bigger one. Let's create one more. Let's go to edit type, here. Uh, let's check here don't have any 450 don't have right right let's duplicate it let's write 450 square millimeter let's go to the structure and here the total thickness we need 450 millimeters so the structure let's make 450 here we are okay okay now this one I want to change to 450 yes nice I don't think so here 500 but maybe who knows it's not so clear um, drawing anyway again 450 we need here and this one uh, how to copy uh, for example when you're drawing you know wanna every time choosing the uh, some type of the wall maybe you need only this wall or this wall just click on this wall cs oh sorry i changed language cs and now we just copy it or you can just uh, click on them and here create similar okay let's put it here just I'm using the space to reverse the face and I'm drag now dragging now this one 
so okay what about this one it's uh, totally one one thousand five hundred it's for sure one thousand maybe it's one thousand six hundred yes this is more right what about this one this one let's check it from here to here okay it's uh, 3000 as I said we not will copy mm, this uh, building we just following the idea of this building because uh, it's impossible actually copying by picture okay now this one I want to connect with that one uh, you cannot see anything it's okay I will change to this mode now we can see everything so let's uh, select everything now okay it's everything it's connect I will use command di because oh I don't wanna from the world center I wanna from the faces okay okay the nice result uh, this is uh, nice and here also okay let's check this one also okay not bad what about that one oh I don't like this number I and maybe your teacher will also don't like this number uh, what we can do let's let's check it what we can do and one more I think no everything here okay so we can move everything by uh, 60 no to this way yeah I will move this one and you so, for example, uh, you don't know mm, the number, uh, the finished number uh, which you need to move, for example. I want a 2000, right? So, I can uh, write like this. Uh, like uh, 2000, sorry, uh, equal 2000 minus 1968. Done. He will calculate for us. <laughs> okay now I like this dimensions we can continue so here this our shaft here will be uh, our uh, leaf oh I lift this will be our staircase okay let's select all, all of them and I need check the uh, height here unconnected height 8 meters this is bad we need connected because this is level 1 we need connect to level 2 let's check it uh, uh, even in 3d let's check it so as you see now it's connected to the next floor but what I don't like uh, it's connected uh, till finish of our floor let's select everything and here base of set we don't need we need uh, top of set minus 150 like this okay now it's okay uh, now we need to create uh, our staircase here yes I think yes I think yes we need we need to create our staircase let's do it so uh, if I will check here one two three four five Uh, here around 21 20 21 uh, steps uh, let's go to the our stair uh, I will use monolith stair standard stair don't do anything uh, and let's write like 21 stair stairs rises sorry uh, from level 1 to level 2 and don't forget base of set 0 top of set 0 okay he gives that to us okay doesn't matter and I wanna uh, draw from the right side uh, here 10 stairs uh, yes 10 stairs here and 11 stairs here okay uh, let's go ah first we need a uh, section view for that one we will go to the view uh, here we cannot do no section okay first we will apply these changes doesn't matter about the wrongs 
uh, let's go to the view section let's create one more section here uh, the section is uh, view we need go to the working okay now section by working floors yes section by working let's go inside and as you see here we can see now clearly our uh, like this okay uh, let's see the our staircase yes we need one more step let's go inside uh, let's delete this uh, handrail we don't need it for now uh, let's see how we can prepare it we need one more actually so the base of set uh, end riser okay uh, okay top high 4000 why it's 3008 yes nice now it's 4000 and now it's everything okay and we will a bit move sorry we will move uh, our staircase to the end let's put this staircase this side here yes now everything okay uh, let's go back uh, first yeah apply this so let's go back uh, let's change the view yes the last stair here and we're going outside okay look okay but actually we can do one more thing because this is first he no wanna do like this okay i will do here one more stair here and it's going back no okay anything and uh, anyway uh, let's making it this one bigger uh, here it's 1000 let's do 1200 okay i'm using command let's delete this one i'm using command align align to the wall 2000 oh it's okay now ah no actually our wall is more bigger yes command align ways modify align our wall to our stair okay actually i want to change the way it's starting i want us more steps from this side okay now it's okay and i want it to make a bit bigger 1200 and this one too let's create 1200 okay uh, now select everything uh, and select this one selection box with selection box we can control uh, what we draw like this okay as you see we get our staircase it uh, looks not bad uh, actually it should be finished here uh, let's check it but it's already under maximum maximum it's 200 each one uh, rise but we already have 190 so maybe we can move a bit the wall i think we will do that we'll move a bit this wall to 1800 and this one to 4100 like this so now it's okay uh, i will leave uh, this section but i will hide it right click hide hide element uh, how to unhide it e easily just here go to uh, Hidden element, hidden elements, and you can see which elements was hide. Okay, for this one, ah, also we need to uh, create uh, the shaft, uh, shaft for our staircase. How to do that? We will uh, use. Uh, okay, uh, we will go to the second level. 
a level number two. Uh, let's hide. Okay, you, as you see, uh, I will. Uh, I have the section on the level two now and level eight now. For example, I don't want to see any sections. How to do that? Just go to the level one. We already hide our section here. Uh, now we need to use a view template. Go to the view template. Here they have something. Some some view templates. We don't need them. We will create our own. Uh, just copy architecture one and let's say like working working set. Okay, working set. Now let's go inside uh, and annotation. We need to uh, uncheck section. Where's our section? Here, section. Uncheck it. And also we don't need mess because we I don't want to see any mess. Uh, I think it's in the model category. Mess here. It's already unchecked. Nice. Okay. Okay. Now if I will go to the second level, second floor, sorry, and I will apply to view template uh, our working set. And I not I cannot see now the any section because it's uh, by working set it's uh, switch off. So what about this one? Uh, we can see now uh, I, I, as you know under layer we can see level one here, and I'm choosing just uh, the floor level two, edit boundary, and let's draw this boundary like this, like this, like this, and like this. And let's connect our boundary. Okay, like this, and okay, apply. Uh, would you like... Uh, da, da, da. Yes, why not? So guys, what about the column? Uh, let's back to the wireframe view. As you see, because I'm using now um, working set, uh, some function now uh, of I cannot use it because we are using working set. So how to solve this problem? Uh, let's go to the level one. Here the working set. Uh, under working set, I should switch off some function. For example, I wanna save a view scale. I want uh, control uh, display mode, display level, and visibility without working set for now. Later we need that. Under layer and view range also I don't. And switch off this all things and uh, clipping also. Now let's check. Oh, one more thing I forgot. Working set. Uh, shadows model display from here also everything. Okay. Now I wanna switch to wireframe mode. For now is this it, uh, we will continue work with uh, this floor and with the columns and interior walls. We will uh, do it at the, next, uh, at the next video. Don't worry guys, this is a long term uh, sets of the video about the project uh, and we will try to uh, touch all the problems and all the tools of the Revit. Thank you guys and see you next time.